It's that time of year when we honor those in our community who are making an impact, not just by doing good, but multiplying good. Yeah, that's the name of the national organization that puts on the Jefferson Awards. WQAD is one of their media partners, and every year we recognize great people in the Quad Cities area. News 8's David Bullman introduces us to a Wheatland, Iowa pastor who is feeding hundreds of people in need every week. Every Monday morning, perfect. Tessa Cavey and her group of volunteers make the trek from Wheatland, Iowa to Davenport to pick up food for St. Paul's UCC Food Bank. They'll go in the van for the school, and then a thing of the hamburger goes for the school too. And has transformed to feeding the community. We serve Calmus, Wheatland. Do you want pie crust? Dixon, Big Rock. Is she in there? But if you come here, I'm not going to deny you. I never deny anybody food. Everybody's entitled to food. When the program started in 2019, the food bank would distribute 200 pounds of food Just a week. One. Today, it's more than 2,000 pounds of food every week. And an operation that big takes many hands to make it work. Boys, your stacking skills are <laughs> awesome. And Pastor Cavey hopes the volunteers learn valuable lessons along the way. I hope that they learn that it is better to give than to receive. And I hope that instills in their hearts. Because I know that's one thing to say, but it's one thing to feel. Yeah, see ya. Yep. How are you, buddy? To feel that is an awesome thing. It really is. Because the people they're helping are often in the middle of making impossible choices. One lady called and she said, it's either I, I feed my kids, I get my sick child their medicine, or the electricity stays on. So how do you, through the food bank, multiply good? I lead by example. I was taught to lead by example. My parents taught me that, my grandparents taught me that. How's Cal miss? Whether there was anything you could offer or not. Still standing? You lead by example. You like grapefruit? The youth is the future. I try to, to be with the kids all as much as I can. And that's not just St. Paul's kids, that's all the kids in the community. And Tessa says she's learned a lot along the way as well. Jesus taught us that you live by the way he taught you. You know, you live by giving. He gave, he sacrificed himself. If I can do that in any sort of way, I will never be as, as great as what he has done. Nobody will. But if I can sacrifice anything that I have in any aspect in his name, I'm going to do that. Thank you. Have a good night, Kirk. David Bowman, WQAD News 8.